One of the most influential public uh, intellectuals today is Jordan Peterson, and he talks about meaning in life very often. Are you familiar at all the, with, with Peterson, and have you read or listened to any of his work? And if so, what, is, what, what are your thoughts on what he has to say? I had dinner with him last week. Oh, okay. <laughs> he is a profound thinker and a passionate thinker. I enjoyed the meal and was very impressed with his mind. He is courageous and he is impassioned. And he is open to looking for the meaning of life. He is searching himself. I don't want to go any further in saying what we talked about, but quite clearly from the interviews, even yesterday, I think he said something like on Joe Rogan, mm -hmm. Christian faith is way more true than just true. Mm -hmm. Now, some people listen to the search for the meaning of life, say, listen to arguments like a theistic proof, just as an armchair exercise. Jordan Peterson is staked on it with his whole life. And I greatly admired him and my heart went out to him. He, he was a wonderful man and an extraordinary human being. Very courageous too, of course, in his fight against all that wokeism is doing to the universities and to business. Wow. Wow. Well, I'm glad to hear that. And I actually just, I haven't seen the whole episode yet, but I did hear that same clip as well. He, you know, he said that uh, the Bible uh, is like, is the truth beneath truth. I think is the way he put it. It made me think of the way that uh, Schaefer used to talk about mm -hmm. uh, how Christianity is not just truth, but it is truth with a capital T. True truth, he used to call true, it. True truth. <laughs> People used to laugh at him, but I call it the reality of reality. That's why it's important you take freedom. Our Lord says, you will know the truth, and the truth will set you free. There's no freedom without truth. So in the postmodern world, we've got no freedom. So people have got to start taking some of these things much more seriously again.